today I will be watching every single one of Eric's videos in a different location. With each video, the location will just get crazier and crazier. With the last location being the absolute craziest place to ever watch a video. I want to be just like Eric when I grow up, a YouTube superstar. That's the reason why I'm watching every single video he's ever made. That's the second Eric video done with. We're going to watch the third Eric video. Literally just asked for a like and subscribe in the first couple seconds. They're literally in the Stranger Things town right now. Ooh! As I watch all of these videos, I'm looking for the number one reason Eric succeeded. Yeah! All right! First real video, guys. I'm headed to the second spot to watch the fourth video overall. Oh, I'm gonna watch this fourth video right here. Sneaking into the Hawking's lab. Yeah, that is the end of the trash can in the middle of the yard session. I'm learning a lot about Eric. The next place, the next video, let's go. So I don't know who uh, came up with all these places for me to watch videos in, but uh, apparently um, I'm watching my next video in, uh, in, in this dumpster right here. So it's full of garbage, go. Number five out of 95 different videos. I rode a skateboard across the entire state of California. With every video I watched, they got better and better and better. Eric, high five to you, bro, because this is the way to do it. Ugh. Number six, be on top of my roof and watch the next video. Ugh. On the roof, guys. Wow. Video number six, and uh, we're going on to video number seven. And there you have it. The end of uh, video number seven, guys. I'm literally leaving my house now. We're going to a different location. And um, yeah, so I'll see you guys another time. Bye, have a great time. Our, uh, we're watching Using disguises to get into any music festival. You know what, director, hey, uh, cut this. I like singing in a music festival, and I'm not sorry about it. And because I don't want you to get bored and click off, here's the next 41 videos really quickly. Hopefully I'll have an editor for this video to make it way better than it actually is. For those of you wondering, I did have an editor for this video, and shout out to Owen for editing this whole video, it turned out pretty amazing. His link to his Instagram is in the description down below, give him a follow while you're here. Also, I realized I haven't asked for a like or a subscribe this entire video. If you're still here, please smash that like button and hit the subscribe and notifications bell. Episode number 50, done, gone. Just for proof, guys, here are all the um, red lines below the phone. If I can get it to actually focus here. Red lines, 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 red lines. It just proves that I've watched all of these videos. Day three of watching every Iraq video until I get to the most epic spot. So, here's the deal. This is what happened today. I watched all the way up to video number 72. I had to take care of the kids. I had to go to bed. You know, I got, I got a life. And I'm gonna watch the videos, the last videos in the most epic spots you've ever seen anybody watch videos. I'm gonna go to work. I'm gonna watch as many videos as possible. And also I have all the red lines showing that I watched all of these videos. And then after work, we're gonna go uh, watch the videos in the most epic spots, so. Day three, let's go. Welcome to the fair guys, Volusia County Fairgrounds. And uh, just our luck, we were walking up and some lady gave me free, four, four free tickets. Four free tickets, can you believe that? While you may believe that I got four free tickets for this fair, it is unbelievable that I forgot to hand over my 
GoPro footage to the editor. So a lot of this footage, uh, like this roller coaster right here, is not as epic as it should be. But anyhow, the point is, I watched all these videos in the most epic spot on the Ferris wheel, on the roller coaster, and the next spot is even cooler. Next thing I'm gonna do is ride a bull. Filling out a waiver so in case I die, they're not liable. Ready? So I'm not the best bull rider in the world. Who would have guessed? Well, right here, the lady was asking me if she wanted to turn it up to full speed for YouTube. I said, let's go. Like I said, not the best bull rider in the world. Okay, so like literally rode it two times. It lasted a total of one minute and 39 seconds. We got another one or two minutes on this video. And then we have two more videos, guys. Two more, we're done with this challenge. Before you guys go, I want to give you my takeaway from watching every single one of Arax episodes. Um, super great guy. I can tell from just watching your videos, bro, that you are like super genuine. And um, you wear Nike socks, and uh, so do I. I wear Nike socks. Another thing I noticed is that Arax believes that if you ask, it will be given. Seek and you will find, knock and the door shall be open. And that is literally a tattooed on my arm that is tattooed on my arm guys asking it will be given all right i live by that if you don't ask in life you're most likely not gonna get what you want because you're not asking you're just expecting people to give and that's not like the way to live life you need to go and ask people knock on the doors and knock doors down keep pushing for what you want guys that's the that's the truth of the matter um that's the main thing i took out of all of Eric's videos is he knocks doors down and he makes stuff happen. He asks and he gets given. He knocks and the door is open. All right? That's the end of the video. Truly, we'll see you next time. Shoo.